Yes, my friends, the Miami Dolphins are catching a lot of people's attention. Behind the scenes in the NFL, there are a lot of people talking about Mike McDaniel's team. And in fact, the Dolphins are surprising with each game. But who will be responsible for all this? I'll tell you what's happening now. But first, make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the like button if you are a passionate fan of the Miami Dolphins. But come on, who is responsible for this year's team's success? Is it our head coach and second-year player, Mike McDaniel, who has been hailed as a genius since his arrival in 2022? Could it be all-pro receiver Tyreek Hill and his speedy team consistently setting the fastest miles per hour speeds for ball carriers every week? Or will it be our once-beleaguered quarterback, Tua Tagovailoa, who redeemed his reputation under McDaniel's guidance, with Hill as his main weapon? Some outsiders questioned whether many, many defenders would excel in Miami's offense. But McDaniel fiercely defended his team, emphasizing that it's all about unity. He stated, it's a team working together, people working together. Me, Tyreek Hill, Tua, that's cool, but what if nobody's blocking anybody? And he is absolutely right. The Miami Dolphins offense is a well-oiled machine and it's not about one individual, it's about the collective effort. His stats speak for themselves, ranking first in nearly every offensive category after six games and even on pace to challenge some of the NFL's all-time yardage and scoring records. The key to its success? They feed off each other. The pre-snap penalties are down, they're getting out of trouble quickly, and it's all translating into games. Tyreek Hill is on pace to break records and become the NFL's first two 0 yard receiver. Who wouldn't want to be a part of this as a competitor? The Miami Dolphins have achieved impressive results in only six games, and their success seems sustainable if they maintain their health and regain key players like Taron Armstead, Connor Williams, Jeff Wilson, and Dave Anacan. Miami's offensive line has allowed merely six sacks in this period, making Tuatagovailoa one of the least sacked quarterbacks in the league. This noteworthy feat has been accomplished even with the absence of Armstead and Williams, who are crucial to the team's offense. Dolphins fans are encouraged to appreciate the remarkable teamwork and talent that has elevated their offense to new heights. Share your thoughts on who deserves more credit for this offensive success in the comments section. Don't forget to like and subscribe for future updates. Fins up!